Hi, this is Nolan Haynes from PresentYourStory.com, and today we're going to talk about one of my favorite little tricks for hiding content on screen in a slideshow, but that you don't actually want to have deleted from your slides for purposes of print or making a PDF. So uh, this slide right here uh, contains a page number. Uh, down in the lower right hand corner, it's a, it's a very large, uh, bold page number, but you don't see it because we're in slideshow mode right now. Uh, on this slide, we also have a page number in the bottom right hand corner, but we, in addition, have a very long detailed uh, note for the chart in very small type that wouldn't be able to be read anyway up on screen, but it is important to have once this gets printed or saved as a PDF. And finally, on this slide, we have a whole lot of information that would be good as a handout for this slide to detail what was said, but for the purposes of presenting this on screen, we didn't need it, all I needed was the, the title. So if I go back to that first slide, the one with just a page number, if I go out of uh, slideshow mode now, you'll see that bottom right hand corner, there's that huge honking page number. Uh, but again, it uh, does not show in slideshow mode. So the way we do this is, uh, it's actually pretty simple. We apply an animation. You can see I've got my animation pane up here. We apply an appear animation, and then right after it, a disappear animation and both these are set uh, to, uh, they're, they're just appear and disappear so they don't have any timing but they're both set after previous so essentially what's happening once the transition renders and we go to the slide the page number appears and then disappears instantly and it happens so quickly that you, it literally do, doesn't show at all now you might be asking uh, why we have to have two animations well the reason is because those transitions do render before any internal slide animation so in this case, if we did have a slow fade on it, uh, like, like we do, you would see a flash uh, of the page number before uh, that, that disappear animation kicked in. So that's uh, for page numbers. You can also apply it to basically any content on your slide, like this small little source note uh, that I, it's not readable on screen and people don't really need to see. And in this last case here, we have a whole bunch of detailed content that really is not appropriate for an on-screen slideshow. But we might want to um, have it there for the audience in, in a PDF. Now you can uh, apply this on a slide-by-slide -slide basis, or you can actually, in the terms, of, in the um, case of page numbers or footnotes or even a logo, you could apply that in the master. And that's very often what we do for templates. We just apply it uh, globally to the master. So anytime somebody's presenting on screen, the page number is not there. Uh, but when they go to print or make a PDF, it is. So that is disappearing content tricks, one of my favorite little uh, hacks for uh, PowerPoint. And uh, check us out at presentyourstory.com uh, for a lot more, including downloadable goodies and, and lots of other information on presenting visually.